How are you? Okay, to begin, my name is Ambassador Julius Bito, PS for Immigration and Citizen Services. And I'm delighted to be here this morning, joined by uh, the leadership of Kericho County, to be able to inspect the new immigration offices that we are, we are planning to launch. Uh, in our last uh, meetings here, uh, the Senator of uh, Kericho County requested the government to open an immigration office in Kericho. So today, with my team of uh, immigration officers, we came here so that we can be able to assess the, the building, the space available, look at the logistics required, the materials required, the equipment required, so that we can be able to open Kericho office. And I'm happy to announce to the public that we are ready to begin as soon as possible to open an immigration office in Kericho. We have looked at the space available and we believe it is sufficient. We have looked at uh, the timelines and we have agreed with the leadership that work will begin immediately towards creating this immigration office in Kericho. And by 1st of January 2024, the, the, the Office of Immigration in Kericho will be operational. So we are going to work very hard together with the assistance of the leadership of Kericho, the Senator, the Area Member of Parliament, and all stakeholders so that we ensure that we bring citizen services closer to the people of Kericho. And uh, for us, we are really excited because it's another opportunity to get closer to the people, to take services to the closer to the people, and to provide the people of Kericho an opportunity to be able to apply and process their passports here. So right from January, people of Kericho don't have to go to Kisumu or Kisi or Nakuru for passports. They just come to this building, they apply in this building, they are processed here, and they are issued their passports right here in Kericho. So it's an exciting moment for our State Department of Citizen Services to be able to provide services in Kericho, particularly uh, passport services, migration services. And it's the first time in the history of our country that we shall be having this kind of services in Kericho County. It will be the first time that we shall be rolling out immigration services, passports, uh, work permits, uh, citizenship, and all the allied services that are related to immigration, we shall be offering them right here in Kericho, starting 1st of January 2024. Thank you. I kabla mwaka huu uishe, tutakuwa na sehemu ya wananchi kuja kujikatia pasporti. Na kwa hivyo siku ya leo PS amekuja, kuangalia nafasi ambayo imetengwa, uh, amepatiana vifaa vyote ambavyo vinatakikana paka ile pesa ambayo inatakikana ili contractor aje na kazi ya ku partition office ianze uh, in the next uh, 30 to 45 days hizi ofisi ziwe tayari alete staff hapa wananchi wetu wakuje waanze kukata pasporti na kusafiri pengine wengine wanajiuliza ni kwa nini tunataka wananchi wafanye hivyo ni kwa sababu rais amekuwa akitembea nchi nyingi uh, duniani na katika kila taifa ambayo zile anatembelea uh, uh, baadhi ya mambo yale anakubaliana na nchi hizo ni kwamba sisi kama Kenya sababu tuna watu ambao wamesoma vizuri na wana maarifa ya kazi tunaweza tukapata fursa ya kufanya kazi katika nchi hizo za ngambo kwa hivyo uwezi kusafiri kama una cheti cha usafiri ambapo kinajulikana kama passport na rais amesema uh, ana target ya wa Kenya zaidi ya bilioni mbili Kupi, kufikia uh, mwaka uh, mwisho wa mwaka ujao wawe wamesafiri na wamepata ajira katika nchi za nje tumekubaliana na tumeweka sehi zile ambazo zinajulikana kwa lugha ya kimombo kama labor bilaterals yani kukubaliana kwa wananchi wetu kwenda kufanya kazi na nchi ya Ujerumani nchi ya Saudi Arabia nchi ya Dubai na nchi nyingi sana ambazo zimekubaliana na sisi kwamba Eh, sababu ya masomo yetu kama wa Kenya sababu ni ya hali ya juu eh, vijana wetu wanaweza kupata kazi katika nchi hizo ndiposa tunasema tunataka by the time 
uh, hizo bilaterals zinaanza kazi vijana wetu hapa kericho wawe tayari na cheti cha kusafiri usiseme kwamba oh ningependa kwenda lakini sina jambo fulani kwa hivyo tutarudi hapa uh, chini ya miezi miwili uh, kuja kufungua ofisi hii rasmi alafu uh, wananchi wetu waweze kukata uh, vieti hivyo na wawe uh, tayari kwa sababu umekuwa PS ya kusema na kutenda. Ah uh, nakumbuka rais alikuwa hapa na tukaomba ya kwamba uh, kupata passport hapa Kericho is a real uh, challenge. So, mtu lazima afanye safari ya kama wiki moja kwenda Nairobi ama Kisumu unaambiwa rudi siku fulani. Uh, so it's a very exp it has been a very expensive uh, exercise uh, to access the passport and immigration services and i want to thank the ps i think you will go down in history because for a very long time getting passports in this country has been uh, uh, something of selected few because uh, it was shrouded with a lot of uh, um, it was very difficult to know how to get a passport but i want to say by you coming here the ritual is going to another another level uh coupled with the, the other day we had uh, the air strip is coming up now the immigration center and other services so i want to say bs uh, you have done a great job you will be remembered that uh, during your time as an uh, ps in charge of immigration you brought uh, services closer to the people of kericho so tunakushukuru sana na rais pia tunamshukuru kwa sababu Amelete services closer to the people. Uh, pengine the other ministries also uh, should follow uh, the same uh, path as you. So nataka kusema watu ya kilicho tunashukuru bwana PS. Karibu tena January. Uh, January umesema tarehe moja. Na fikiria utakuja hapa tuweze ku we officially launch it and we have the service to start uh, officially. Uh, nataka kushukuru the Ministry of Lands hapa kwa kupeana ofisi hapa uh, kwa sababu hii ni ofisi ya serikali so utafanya kazi pamoja sasa tunaenda kutangaza bwana Pierce immigration department is in town yeah sure uh, <laughs> <laughs> and therefore so uh, tunatarajia by January it will be working tutasaidiana pamoja so asante sana tunataka watu wetu wapate fieti wapate kutembea duniani the uh, access opportunities that are there in many countries uh, you know the ambassador uh, the, the ps uh, was an ambassador he knows what happens in other countries mm. myself also was an ambassador mm. we need people to go out of our country access other opportunities and bring money home mm. asante sana